Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. Dealing with NAN, not a number, values is a common task when working with numerical data in Python, especially when using libraries like NumPy. By default, many statistical functions, including the mean, will return NAN if any of the values in the input array are NAN. However, NumPy provides a way to compute the mean while ignoring these NAN values. Hashtag 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 number pi, mean with nan. Hashtag 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 overview. Nan values, represent missing or undefined values in numerical data. Number pi function, numpy.nanmen, computes the mean of an array while ignoring nan values. Hashtag 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 installation. Make sure you have number pi installed in your environment. You can install it using pip if it's not already installed. Hashtag 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 example code. Here's a step-by-step -step tutorial with code examples. Hashtag 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 step 1, import number pi. First, you'll need to import the number pi library. Hashtag 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 step 2, create an array with NAND values. You can create an array that contains some NAN values using numpy.nan or by using numpy.array, with np.nan. Hashtag 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 step 3, calculate mean with NAN. Now, let's calculate the mean of the array, ignoring the NAN values. Hashtag 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 step 4, compare with regular mean. To illustrate the difference, Let's calculate the mean using numpy.mean, which does not ignore NAN values. Hashtag 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 complete example code. Here's the complete code for reference. Hashtag 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 output. When you run the complete example, the output will look like this. Hashtag 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 conclusion. Using numpy.nanmen, is a useful way to compute means in data sets that may contain missing or undefined values without skewing results. This approach is particularly beneficial in data analysis, scientific computing, and machine learning tasks where data cleanliness can significantly impact outcomes. Feel free to explore more functionalities offered by NumberPy for handling NAND values, such as numpy.nanst, for standard deviation and numpy.nanmedian, for median calculations.